Hi, welcome to Medicine with Dr. Moran. Today's video is about echocardiograms. So what is an echocardiogram? This is a safe procedure. It's a painless diagnostic test. It uses high frequency sound waves, so ultrasound, to take moving pictures of the heart. The test is performed by a technician who is called a sonographer, a sonographer meaning sound waves. These sound waves are directed at the heart from a very small handheld transducer, which you can kind of think of as a camera. The transducer utilizes gel in order to get better conduction to send and receive the sound waves that appear on the screen. And it generates an image, a moving image in fact, of the heart. It's in black and white, but color can be added to show blood flow moving in and out of the chambers. Many measurements are taken during the test to determine how well your heart is performing. It allows us to see the heart valves, the heart chambers, and to assess the function of the heart, as well as pressures inside the heart. It does not allow us to see the coronary arteries or to evaluate for blockages in them. Stress testing would be required if we were going to evaluate for coronary artery blockages. I am a registered sonographer myself. I have certification and recertification exams in ECHO, scoring in fact in the top 2% of examinees. Providing accurate comprehensive examinations are important to us. We do use state-of-the-art four-dimensional ECHO equipment with networked four-dimensional interpretation and reporting software. What should people be doing to prepare for the test? You don't really need to do a lot to prepare for the test. First of all, we like it if there's no smoking for a couple of hours before, if you're a smoker. Please do not apply any scented lotions, perfume, or aftershave. We are a fragrance-free office for the comfort of all of our patients. Patients may eat and perform normal activities and continue to take their medications as prescribed by their doctor. The time that we give you has been reserved for you with the sonographer. If for any reason you cannot attend, please call my office to reschedule. We do expect you to attend at your scheduled time. How long does it take to do the test? The test generally takes about 45 minutes from start to finish. My sonographer will perform the test, keeping patient comfort and safety in mind. Is it an uncomfortable test? No, ultrasound does not hurt. It can't be felt. If patients experience any discomfort, they should notify the sonographer performing the test. Generally, we get people to have the test done while they're lying on their left side, which brings the heart up closer to the chest wall so we get better pictures. Some of the images are taken while they're on their back. And we do typically take some pictures with the transducer uh, in the notch right here of your neck. There are no known harmful effects from diagnostic cardiac ultrasound. There's no radiation, for example, like CT or X-ray. There are no material risks to the test. On rare occasions when the transducer is placed between your ribs to get pictures, this might provoke a little bit of discomfort, particularly if your rib space is small or tender. What happens when you arrive for the test? When you come to my laboratory, you'll be asked to sign the bottom of this uh, of an information sheet, giving your consent for the procedure. The information sheet goes over all the points that we're reviewing on this video. Sign this only if you wish to proceed after having read and the fact that you understand and have had an opportunity to ask any questions. My staff are available to help you with that. Once, of course, in the lab, the sonographer will give you a top to put on if you're a lady, your bra needs to be removed. Your height and weight is needed. ECG monitoring reads will be applied and your blood pressure will be taken. You lie on your left side as well as back for your test, as I mentioned. The room's darkened to facilitate us being able to see the images better on our screen. Although the technician performing the test can see what's going on with your heart, she cannot provide any information about the test results to you. This is something your physicians or other healthcare providers will be doing. While you're being scanned, do not talk as this can image 
it can worsen image quality. The test will be interpreted by myself and I will securely send a report to your physician immediately after the test. Thank you for watching today's video about echocardiograms. If you like this video, please give it a like and if you'd like to see more stuff like this, please subscribe. I'm Dr. Keith Morin. Thanks for watching. Remember, get healthy and stay healthy.